、饮水思源、爱国荣孝精神，不仅是属于中国的，也是属于世界的。回答人类的共同的疑问，也是我们中华民族的重要的责任。Shanghai Jiao Tong University, one of China's oldest and most prestigious universities. For the past 120 years, the university has been keeping pace with every step China takes. It nurtured China's best engineers, scientists, and top leaders. It made tremendous contributions to the unbelievable economic growth of China. And it dealt with the country's contemporary problems. It is a mirror of China's evolution and one of the driving forces behind China's remarkable achievements. And it is now on course into uncharted territory, aiming to make groundbreaking discoveries for the benefit of the human race. This is a university and its people, a story of their vision, their devotion, and their extraordinary journey in shaping the future of China and the world. Founded in 1896 as Nanyang College, Shanghai Jiao Tong University is one of China's oldest universities. Today it is a leading university in China. The dream of Jiao Tong University started a century ago from its 11th president, Tang Wenzhi. Tang Wenzhi 老校长的任上，他提出来了交通大学。办学的理念最重要的就是要成就一等的人才、一等的学问、一等的事业，要砥砺一等的品行。During his presidency, Tang Wenzhi pioneered courses in electric engineering, railway engineering, and naval navigation. More importantly, he proposed a long-range vision that shaped the future of Jiao Tong University. His vision was carried forward. And remained a starting point for Jiao Tong University's journey to become a top university. From the class of 1929, Qian Xuesen is a household name in China. He is widely recognized as the father of China's rocketry and space program. One person's self-confidence is not from the sky. In learning, 不输给任何外国人的这种自信心，是他在交大的时候逐步得到培养。Armed with only pen and paper, he laid the blueprint for China's missile program. Later, he became one of the key scientists pioneering China's quest into space. 2,000 kilometers away from Shanghai, a research team is testing water quality at a remote river in China's southwestern province of Yunnan. So today, the Luoxiang water is being extracted. Yesterday, I saw the whole process. Basically, our water is completely restored. They successfully persuaded the central government to include Arhai Lake in China's major science and technology program for water pollution control and treatment. In January 2015, Chinese President Xi Jinping visited Arhai Lake and praised the effort. Today, people in Dali are reaping the benefits of a clean and beautiful Arhai Lake. This session is called an open book examination. The person being quizzed is the 92-year-old Dr. Wang Zhengyi. In the mid-1980s, his research led to an improved survival rate of patients with acute promyelocytic leukemia, or APL, a highly fatal disease. It has been used successfully in China and around the world, 
countless lives have been saved. Deep under these mountains, Chinese physicists are working against the clock, trying to answer one of the biggest mysteries in science. They are determined to capture an elusive substance sent to make up most of the universe's mass. Dark matter. Dark 在建设世界一流大学的历史进程中啊，一定能够白纸竿头，不断进步。